Hello friends, uh, so I hope all of you understand that for any exam, getting an insight into the previous year topics, the recent topics is very, very important because that is what helps you to understand into what is the trend of the questions and topics being asked in the recent exams. And that's the very reason that I've compiled the surgery INICT PYQs of the year 2024 and 2025 for you. So basically three sessions, May 24, November 24 and May 25, which will help you to get the insights into what questions have been asked in surgery or we are going to discuss here. You can download this PDF for free and other subjects PYD PDF also for free from the Medicine apps app by Dr. Nagata. I'll uh, quickly tell you on how to do that as as well uh, so what you need to do is download medicine apps app by dr nikita on the home page you would see this pyt's pyqs if not if you scroll down here you will see the courses and in the courses you will see this pyt pdf you can uh, get the access to this for free absolutely at no cost and apart from that if you are struggling to remember some difficult topics or you are stuck with the stagnant gt scores uh, the short shot plus extra videos which is around 80 hours on the medicine apps app is definitely going to be a game changer in your preparation along with so many test and discussion videos which help you develop mcq solving skills so do check it out uh, in the short short course by dr nikita now uh, diving into the surgery INICT PYQs. So if you see the number of questions in surgery that are asked in INICT, that's an average of uh, 15 to 18 questions is what you can see. May 24, 15 questions, November 24, 18 questions and May 25, 17 questions. And which are the most important systems that you need to focus on? GIT hepatobiliary is something which is very, very important. You can see maximum questions here. Then comes the trauma and thorax. In thorax, the questions have been asked on pneumothorax. That's a very, very important topic. Then you have general surgery, which is very, very important. So let's have a quick look one by one uh, based on the topic that what questions have been asked. So first one uh, that you see here in general surgery the first question has been on obesity and cancer risk the question was there is no increased risk with obesity for meningioma then there's a question on negative pressure dressing uh, then we have question on uh, what fluid is used in mood bar clay formula pressure sore grading has been asked quite few times so this is important then you have wound healing by uh, learn the primary secondary and tertiary intention ERAS protocol, enhanced recovery after surgery. Uh, the question asked was prolonged fasting is not suggested. Uh, remember that has been asked. So that is what is asked in general surgery. In breast, if you look at the questions, apart from the breast cancer staging, which is very, very important, we'll see that in cancer staging. In breast, again, the question has been asked on breast conservation surgery. What is indication? What is contraindication? And what is the ER, the estrogen receptor test done for? That's as a prognostic mark. In trauma and uh, thorax, pneumothorax is something which is very, very important. So there have been three questions on pneumothorax. Apart from that, uh, the question on primary survey for trauma. What investigations are included in primary survey and the adjuncts in primary survey? That has been asked. Remember, in adjunct, the CT abdomen is not included. Triage color coding is important. Then you have the EDH management that has been asked. Next comes GIT and hepatobiliary. Very, very important. So, hepatocystic triangle boundaries, Passaro triangle boundaries, which is for gastrinoma, that has been asked. There have been questions on scores and the true love which classification, which is used for ulcerative colitis. Upper GI, esophagus pathologies are very, very important. Like you see, question on Zenker's barium image has been asked. Echelasia barium image has been asked. GERD extra esophageal complications plus the upper GI bleed management. Apart from that, there has been bariatric surgery question in the recent exam. Identify the type of surgery. Alvarado score calculation was asked, which is used for appendicitis. Acute pancreatitis lab findings, the lipase, amylase, calcium that was asked. Upper GI again, how does CA esophagus present? Right in echelasia, there's dysphagia more to liquids, uh, while here it is more to solids. And cholangiocarcinoma risk factors have been asked. Most common hernia in females and indirect inguinal hernia, plus you have the upper GI bleed management.
coming to thyroid parathyroid uh, in thyroid of course the thyroid surgery the complications of that is important and the management of uh, thyroid nodule thyroid mass so thyroid cancer management especially if it is uh, the question was it is radiation induced it is always surgery total thyroidectomy thyroid surgery complement recurrent laryngeal nerve injury can be seen in which step Question on medullary thyroid carcinoma where it was given that uh, uh, amyloid is present pointing towards medullary thyroid cancer. So it is originating from parafollicular cells and then the question on parathyroid adenoma and the Miami criteria. In urology there have been uh, questions on image based question of corpora amylacea triple phosphate stone the coffin lid appearance remember the trick for uh, true white that is triple phosphate so it is stag horn calculus tr it is triple phosphate u for urease positive organisms like proteus and white for wearing the white clothes for funeral so remember funeral that is coffin lid appearance is with true white triple phosphate stone okay so that is the trick that you remember then there's a question on Wilms tumor that has been asked. Coming to CVTS, very, very important. Peripheral vascular disease is something which is very important with question on intermittent claudication and ABPI values. Then you have questions in plastic surgery, cleft lip surgery. What is the first muscle repaired? Orbicularis oris. Question on nerve grafts, uh, Z plasty, dog ear surgery, image based question has been asked. Now, this is uh, something that majority of the students dread. What cancer staging to read for the exam? So, in the last three sessions of INICT, CA colon, CA breast, and basically oral cavity cancer is something that has been asked. So, definitely you should be reading this CA colon, breast, and oral cavity. Out of that, you can see that breast cancer has been asked so many times, like the pudiorang staging, the TNM staging, and even the inflammatory carcinoma was given, which is stage 3B. Then in instruments, there has uh, been question on laparoscopy, the various angles. A uh, question was on azimuth angle. And then there has been image-based question on percutaneous endoscopic gastrostomy. So what is the take-home point uh, from looking at the list of the last three sessions of INICD exam is that GIT, hepatobiliary pancreas, is a very important system. In that upper GIT, the esophagus pathologies are very, very important important uh, right and uh, second trauma plus pneumothorax is something which is very important trauma uh, management primary survey is something that you have to know really well then you have general surgery which is uh, important topics in general surgery like you have wound healing cut topic uh, which is very frequently asked and the complications related to wound healing uh, right eras protocol is something that can be asked again and should be definitely done and uh, apart from that breast cancer is something that you would uh, generally see one question on breast cancer uh, any question related to maybe surgery pathology integrated right these are very very important uh, topics for surgery for INICT so uh, you can download this pdf again from the Synapse app by Dr. Nikita for free and other pdfs also uh, in case you have any other queries related to your preparation please do let me know in the comments I shall also be sharing uh, the link on where to download this pdf or access the other uh, pyt pdfs uh, in the description of this video and also I shall be pinning it in the comments Thank you so much. Uh, if you've liked this video, do share it with your friends as well. And do not forget to subscribe to our channel. Thank you.